A click, click, click noise when going around a sharp turn isn't someone starting a slow clap. It is, however, a pretty good sign that the CV axles on a vehicle are in need of some attention. Let's take a look at some ways to properly diagnose a worn CV axle. This video is sponsored by GSP North America. Over 35 years of manufacturing CV axles, loaded strut assemblies, hub assemblies, and much more. Visit gspnorthamerica.com for more information. CV axles are the link between your transmission and your wheels. Their design allows them to follow the suspension while still being able to move the vehicle. There are a number of things that we can look at to see if a CV axle is going bad. One of the simplest driving tests that you can do is to take a vehicle to an open parking lot and slowly drive in circles with the steering wheel turned sharp in each direction. This puts the joints at a CV axle in the sharpest angle possible and will often cause ones that have gone bad to make a clicking noise where the bearings bind up a bit. Next up, it's time to get the vehicle in and on a lift so you can give a good visual inspection. The first thing that you will want to look at are the boots that cover the CV joints. Any rips or tears in these boots will allow the grease to get out and dirt to get in. Once dirt or water has entered a CV joint, it will cause damage to the bearings and the bearing surfaces in the joint and it will need replaced. Something else to take note of is if you have an end of the axle free, check to make sure that the slip joint moves freely without binding. If there's any binding or resistance, it's time to replace the CV axle. Diagnosing CV axle issues doesn't need to be complex if you know the right things to look for. I'm Josh Trokey, and thanks for watching.